and for years there it just didn't even feel even at all within reach to not have to wear the neck brace. It was just so unbearable to have it off. I just wanted to give you an update on the neck brace, so it's good news. I am pretty much not wearing my neck brace at all during the daytime, and I'm really not wearing it in the car either, which that has been the new exciting update. Um, I think it was my fifth treatment at Caring Medical that Dr. Hauser just said, yeah, you know, start experimenting with keeping it off in the car for short rides and just see how you go, give it, give it some time and just use it as something to sort of like exercise your neck. I started doing that and it's been going fine and I've gotten to the point over the last couple months where I am really not wearing it in the car almost at all unless I am just having sort of a more difficult day than usual and or if I'm in the car for a really long time. We just traveled on an airplane last week and I did wear my neck brace on the airplane, but just because we had a lot of travel time, I wasn't quite ready to uh, have the turbulence and stuff with my neck, but I know I'll get there. And so really, the only time that I'm wearing my neck brace is when I sleep. And I've actually had a couple nights where I've been able to sleep without the neck brace. I found that it still leaves me not feeling great um when i don't wear it so that's why i've been continuing to wear it but at my last prolotherapy appointment dr hauser was saying you know if you can find a good way to not wear it at night then that's what we want he just said yeah you want to be living a normal life you don't have to bring this thing around with you everywhere you go um and you know of course i'm thankful for having it as i have needed it over these years but I'm really thankful to be able to be coming out of it and for years there I really really it just didn't even feel even at all within reach to not have to wear the neck brace it was just so unbearable to have it off and now I'm fine I cannot wear it I'm not wearing my neck brace I'm totally fine and I even have moments of having zero pain and my neurosurgeon said that I would be in pain forever and of course he didn't want that but he said realistically you'll probably be in pain forever and just seeing these glimpses of having zero pain is just incredible I mean it's hard to describe how amazing that feels I guess I just wanted to share that having my craniocervical fusion surgery is not why I'm out of the neck brace at all um, I was very reliant after my surgery for long periods of time and it was only the prolotherapy and my change in diet that, to the carnivore diet, that helped me to be able to stabilize my neck. And also, of course, brain retraining DNRS has been very helpful as well. And it's difficult when I'm doing all these things at once to know exactly how much success to attribute to each effort. Um, but overall, I just know that all those things have been really helping me and I do want to make another video where I share just my raw feelings on my surgery. I do know it was a part of my story for a reason, even if it's just to share that there are other ways to heal. Um, so anyways, just feeling really thankful that I'm not having to use this brace much anymore and wanted to share that victory with you guys. The sun is just come out from behind the trees so it's really bright now but if you're really in the thick of it right now and you're struggling just know that I'm cheering you on I'm thinking of you just keep believing that healing is possible because it absolutely is um, there's always always hope even in the most severe of situations so, so that's my quick update for the day hope you guys are having a great week and I will look forward to seeing you again very soon